Um, I'm gonna start talking about this time. I learned something in my life. I learned something in my life. I'm not interested. I'm not interested in any of it above. I'm not interested, but. Um, so. Honestly, can I be more than relieved, honestly? It's more than relieved. It was not a fan. Honestly, it was. Honestly, relieved. But, I'm doing a different stock evaluation right now. Um, I'm going to do match.com. Not match, but, um... Let's see, eliminate, but, um, I'm going to show you stock analysis, um, so, um, should we turn in growth into income? Stock is down 60% by its peak. Long term, it's another great stock. Should you buy a shoe stock right now? They continue to put impressive numbers, but the stock knows that the latest earnings report has become a go to online destination for pet owners. The shop for food and other supplies. The company's increasing skill has ever allowed it to expand into pet healthcare. It's an attractive industry investing with the pet market historically growing on 5%. The share price has declined because of earnings and stuff. The revenue grew to 47% $2,020 in mass selected products across roughly 2,500 pounds. In the quarter, up 21% in active customers. So revenue increased 29%. They expected to grow 25%, 26%. Pet food on speed dial. Great company, but stock is expensive. It's expensive, um, but... I mean, long term is a great thing, whatever. Mm. Again, never interested. Why is this stock getting beat up? I don't understand. Why does this stock, my top three e commerce stocks to buy right now? Chile, last year's lockdowns caused many customers to acquire new pets, with veterinarians reporting a 50% increase in new pet visits between March and August. Consumers want a lot of food. 6.73% increase. So the most low online pet supplies. So their, their goods up up 47%. Basically, this is a great three highest growth stocks. Chewy is one of them. So it's pet food online, and revenue has been growing at 50% annual rate over the last three years. The broader pet food industry is growing about 6% compound annual growth rate. They're not even close to running out of growth revenue. It's pushing the bowls, toys, and other accessories. Yeah. That's a good one. This is a good one. It's a good one. This is a good stock.